So, just on our way back to Mirabuka Shopping Centre, we got we put up one panel and basically we ran into a bit of mischief. It was we we're having trouble with it sticking and the wall wasn't cleaned properly and started raining. Started raining. So yeah, Dean made the decision to basically pull the pin and go and catch up on a job in the city. And yeah, so we just finished that off and we're on our way back to Mirabuka now. So. The weather's cleared up, it's sunny, so we're hoping the, uh, hoping the wall was heated up a bit and it should make it a little bit easier for our stencil to stick on, but we've still got a lot to do, there's painting to be done, um, so we're hoping we get it all done today. Yeah, I know, and I'm, I'd... I'll be stressed. Anyway, let's go. Alright. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> Welcome back to another video. Welcome back. So, in this video, um, we work with a local artist, Lindsay Carter. So, she does a lot of like um, wall murals and painting and colourful artwork and just all sorts of crazy cool, cool stuff. Cool stuff, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> Um, anyway, for this project, we worked with her at Mirabuka Shopping Centre. So we had to create a whole bunch of mandalas that kind of spanned the outside um, wall of the shop. Um, various sizes, I think they range from like maybe a metre and a half to two metres up to about four metres in diameter. So they were pretty big. Um, yeah, it was, it was a pretty fun project to work on. Yeah, it was pretty fun actually, Dean. Wow, <laughs> it sure was. Yeah, so on our end, we basically vinyl cut these stencils and installed them onto the outside of the walls and then gave her a hand painting over them at the end and then removing them and we were left with these amazing mandalas. They were so. amazing. So the reason we did them as stencils was because they're obviously very intricate shapes. Originally, she was kind of thinking maybe hand painting them all on, but it just wasn't feasible to do that. So. Yeah, so we hope you guys enjoy the video. That was my way of saying we saved the day. 